Good afternoon, I'm Mike Powers. Ellen Snyder, the woman accused of killing her husband and burying his body outside their Albuquerque home, faced a judge this morning. News 13's David Romero joins us now with details. David? Well, Mike, Ellen Snyder is charged with first-degree murder for the death of her husband, Michael Snyder, back in 2002. She claimed she shot him because he had abused her. In district court this morning, Snyder pleaded not guilty. Her attorney told Judge Charles Brown that the case should be considered a domestic violence case and not a murder case. Therefore, she asked Judge Brown to lower Snyder's $1 million bond. She also requested that Snyder be released into her mother's custody or be monitored by a GPS-equipped bracelet. We also... I don't think there's any evidence at all that Ellen is a danger to the community. And given her ties to New Mexico, her family here, her employment here, the fact she has a house here, all make it really unlikely, given that she had lots of time she could have left, that she's going to not show up for court. Now, Judge Brown denied all of Snyder's requests. Mike, back to you. Okay, David, thank you. Judge Brown did tell Snyder and her attorney that they can file a motion to reconsider the bond when they appear before the judge who will permanently be assigned to this case.